I think the private philanthropic effort to engage the people who have the money, I think it's essential to get them engaged. We all live on the same planet and they know how to do things well. They happen to do them in the business environment. A lot of that's been learned in business is being applied in it for non-business purposes, for humanitarian purposes. <laughs> we were founded by a, a war immigrant refugee 75 years ago who Hitler tried to recruit as an industrialist. And he famously called Hitler an idiot which is why he became a refugee and fled to California with some of his wealth and tax. That was the roots of direct relief, kind of a war immigrant businessman who saw that what was needed in bombed out post-war Europe were things that we knew how to do as a society. And so he was trying to do it himself and engage people like him. So I think we've t- still tried to retain that engagement of private people, private business with a broad lens you know, of the humanitarian impulse and put those together without screwing up either the market or supplanting the role of government it's complementary. It's got to be locally driven or it's, it, it fails inherently.